You are playing this character. Hey, are you okay? What's wrong? I only need the letter N to complete the word yo man. They lie to you. There was never an N letter. It's just a marketing ploy. Hey, calm down. Why are you so obsessed with it anyway? A grand prize. A brand new bike. I can't afford a bike for my son. I thought with the prize, surely I... Hmm. So you need a bike. Yo man guy say something about wanting a bike. some letter N crap. I want this, right? Yes. All I want is for my son to... Noah. Papa. Please don't be sad anymore, Papa. son. I thought I was doing the right thing, but it's okay, Papa. Will you teach me how to write it, please? My boy. Here, you can have this. We don't need it anymore. Go see my son. Huh? That yeoman robber I just got. The Emma looks kind of smudge. This was drawn with a marker pen. Could it be fake? Mm. I guess it still counts for my bucket list. And done.
Hey, Mr. Co-Writer. Yeah? Help yourself to the rest of the gum, please. What are you doing with all of this, anyway? <sighs> I want a bike. But my dad yelled at me when I... when I asked for one. So I figured I'd try to collect all the letters from the Yeoman Bubblegum Contest thingy. Maybe I can get a bike without having to bother my dad. Hmm. I think I saw a bike that someone had thrown out over the swamp. You want me to go dumpster diving? Use your ears, Missy. I said a swamp, not a dumpster. Same thing. People throw out their trash there. If they're throwing the whole thing out, it's not likely to be in good condition, is not is it? I mean, who knows if it even works? Exactly. Who knows? But we can sure find out. If some parts don't work, we'll scourge for new ones to replace them with. Hmm. Come on, be fun. Imagine having a bike that you built all by yourself. Well, you and me, together. Think about it. Ugh. Chewing bubblegum all day makes makes want to barf. Ugh. Hey, step it up! Get chewing! Huh? What the hell is that? Ugh, my head. was supposed to bring us untold blessings, but... My life has been nothing but misery! Emilio. That's right. My love life has gone down the drain. David. I failed my exams. Frank. The company went bankrupt. Hey, Kibbo. What the hell are you playing at? Hey! Answer me, you useless bull! That's the Kibbo bull from the festival. Hey, wait. Please don't hurt the bull. She's right! Had you forgotten? You're supposed to treat the bull with their utmost respect during the ritual. Ritual? Please. What's the point of a ritual if it doesn't bring prosperity? That's the whole point. That is not real. Kira. Yes, okay. <laughs> Please. Came from bull. I beg you. Please. They're hurting me. Hey! Stop hurting the bull! Or else. 
Or what, kid? Huh? Huh? Crap. Marin, get behind me. This kid is insane. Run. Thank you for your aid. Come closer. I will allow you to pet me. Uh, you will? I've heard lots about you, young man. You've made friends with every single animal around town. As such, His Highness has requested an audience with you. His... Highness? A mighty beast who rules over, over... Sorry. A mighty beast who rules over us mere creatures. Many believe he is nothing but a myth. How wrong they are. Barong Puppet Mask? What's, what's it doing here? Poor thing. I fear all alone. I... I can space dive to Barong? This is... Where am I? Whoa! It's... alive? It won't bite me, right? Roland. N nolan So, you're Atma. Sorry, I didn't know. Don't be. Please, bet me once more. Okay. Yes, I can feel kindness in your touch. Every animal in town talks about you. Apparently, you've pet and given names to all the strays. I did. They're glad of it, you know. It makes them feel that they have a place in the world. I never knew a name meant so much to them. Names have power. Almost like magic. It is our identity, the first steps to understanding ourselves. I only show up to those who love animals. Like that little kid a long while ago. I feel the sincere love you have towards us. And for that reason, I'm here on behalf of all the animals to say thank you. The world needs more people like you. You're welcome, Balrog. Tell me, young lad. Did you enjoy petting those animals? I did, but... I don't know where I saw for wise as you. Good to know your wish has been fulfilled. You know what to do, I trust. There you go. That's done. I have something for you to remember, Atma. Huh? Namala, you really love cats, huh? Well, they're cute. 
And once you gain their trust, they become loyal friends. Hmm. I have other friends beside these cats, right? Well, obviously. A dog, a cat, even a white bull. Besides those. Uh, how about the King of Beasts? A lion? No, silly. A mythical one. Here, let me draw him. Very majestic, right? Indeed. Why'd you come to meet a mythical beast? Do you know the swamp just right behind the elementary school? Didn't they build that over that a few years back? Yeah, but when it was still there, I used to go there to skip school. He, uh... He only appears to people that truly love animals. And are loved back by those animals, of course. How do you make animals love you back? Well, you, you pet them on their tiny little heads, of course. It's a universal language. I see. What if animals love me too? It's entirely possible. Wow, you succeeded in getting me off topic. I meant to ask if you have human friends? Maybe at school? Hmm. I don't think I was made to befriend humans. Except you, of course. Well, you're alone like I am. That doesn't mean there aren't loads of people that would want to be your friend. I hope you find at least, I hope you at least find your place in the world. M my place? I don't know if such a place exists. What about somewhere full of cats? Somewhere like a cat wonderland? Oh, uh, indulge me. What's Cat Wonderland? A place akin to paradise for cats and cat lovers. Full of fluff and cat food and places to frolic. <laughs> that sounds wonderful! I want to go there. You can write about it. Oh, I definitely will. That. My head hurts. Huh? The bar mass in the cuba bowl has gone missing? I don't know what happened. Are you okay? N nothing. Let's go. Mary, school's just right ahead. Come on.
don't have time to waste. Let's go. Baron, wait! Ugh. What? Baron! They're still inside! No, 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 no. The crash site. Dribbled right there. Are, are they? No. Please, no! Damn it! I can't get in this way! Magic Rot 1 is reacting. May an explosion create a rift? Get in there quickly. There's no ton of waste. Timeline. It'd be a lot easier, right? Kyle. Hey, anyone seen Rhea? Kira. I think she's skipping school. Why are you looking for that freak? Want to join her cult? As if. Lulu's out for blood. Probably going to actually murder her this time. <laughs> Not bad. If there's one person I'd never want to mess with, it's Lulu. Oh, what I'd give to be the fly on the wall when Lulu finally gets her hands on her. Talk like that about Rhea. It's just horrible. Why do they hate her so much? That aside, I guess I won't find her anyway around here at this moment. I should find another way. Or another time? That piece of paper nut trash. This form again. It's been crumpled up and scribbled on with pen. Someone wrote the name here, but and scrawled over it and everything else. So I started filling this out, but now it's totally illegible. What is this? A formula? I don't recognize it. 11 equals 2e plus i. Maybe I should write this down.
I did it. I think that's me, right? Yeah. yeah. Uh, Marwa. Marwa? Lenny. You did it? Where did you hide it? The back of the cafeteria, near the trash cart where it belongs. <laughs> Amazing. That freak will never find your bag back there. She's gonna be all like freaking out. Jesus. Oh, man. Huh? Contents of this bag have been spilled everywhere. It could be heartless enough to do this. Wait, these belong to... This is Rhea's bag. Rhea never told me that she was bullied. What other parts of her life I don't know about? I want to know everything. I want her to be able to tell me. The bag is really dirty now. It's kind of hard to look at it. What is this? A formula? N equals 4. I should probably write that down. Reacted. There must be an unopened rift nearby. That's a weird formula. 2k equals 3n. Yo, back up, boss. This is, boss is a little touchy right now. He just got turned out by a girl. That's a weird formula. 3 minus 3 n equals negative i. This tail has been pretty badly vandalized. It's covered in horrible insults.
Was it David? These were the quiz bros. I don't know if it was me, but I can take it if need be. Go for it. Oh man, high school's almost over. That might have been Frank, I think. Frank? No more hiking club meetings. I know, right? I never even got a girlfriend. Someone I can watch a movie with, snuggled up in a dark room eating candy. That's the whole point of high school. It's the dream, the ideal teen date. My heart is throbbing. Mine too. Let's do it. Uh, huh? Let's watch a movie together. You mean with the rest of the club? No, dummy. Do I really need to say it? I'm asking you out. A movie date. Just the two of us. It's a piece of paper to top this locker. It said, Property of Nikon. It's the infamous confiscated goods locker. Just a padlock, but what's the combination? Well, time to do some math.
Hmm, wait. His favorite top is Nikon. The infamous confiscated goods locker. There's a padlock. What's the combination? Yes, it's unlocked. Oh, whoa, there's a lot of weird stuff in here. What the heck is that? Aha, here's the crowbar. I need to break down the wall. Hey, nice. Thanks, dude. Uh, nah, I don't need this. Where's the darn screwdriver? Everything's all messy. Can't she at least put everything in its correct place? This hammer might come in useful for destroying the ball. Standing strong, but I caught a good progress with it. 
made it while it collapses as time passes. Still standing strong, but I make quite a good progress with it. Back to the future. Aha! Huh, just like I thought. Weak enough that a plane crash made it collapse. And I'm finally inside. I need to find Rhea Marin. Where could they be? This isn't you, Rhea. It's not right. Voice. It's Marin. She's talking to Rhea. They must be all right. Marin! Rhea! Where are you? No answer. I need to find them. Is she away again? I think she said that a bit ago, yeah. God damn it. Kyle. This has nothing to do with you. That's Rhea's voice. It has everything to do with me. Listen. Rhea doesn't have to answer to you. What you've done to her? Huh? That's a guy's voice. Who's that? I need to get closer. <sighs> no, I think. Oh, student? At this hour? Huh? What are you up to? Why are you still here? Do you, do you have detention? Uh, haven't you seen? Sir, the school's been destroyed. Are you alright? Why didn't you evacuate? You should get out of here. What the hell are you talking about? Are you on something, kid? What's your name? I'm gonna write you up. I'm Atma, sir. You know me. Adma? You're definitely on something. Adma's right here, look. Huh? What? Uh, what the hell? Who... Who are you? This student's a bad apple. A troublemaker. Right. Get rid of him. Yes. Ow! Please stop, <laughs> sir. This isn't you. Don't talk to me. Don't talk like you know me, Brad. Ugh, 
course I know you. I'm the real Atma. What are you talking about? Ugh. I'm never confused. I can explain. No. No. This is wrong. Ugh. Damn. Brad. This. Happened to me. Do you remember me now, Atma? Yeah. <sighs> Atma, I don't know. Atma. What? Of course you do. Please let me through. Th this is important. Ugh. I have to. I have to get rid of you. I'm sorry, sir. I didn't have a choice. I need to find Rhea and Marin. Maybe they're at the yard. Flatter yourself, girl. What worth could you possibly have in Rhea's eyes? That's enough, honey. Rhea! Marin! Gone. Th that's why I made another you. What? Another me? I was devastated. I didn't have a choice. But now, we can be together. You want that too, right? What are you talking about, Rhea? That's not me. What happened to you? even more complicated. Don't you worry. Just sit tight. I'll make everything better again. I just have to erase this nuisance. Rhea, I... I'm sorry for doubting you, Rhea. Please, tell me how to make this right. It's too late. The wheels are already in motion. The end will come soon enough. No, please. Can't things go back to the way they used to be in the old days? Writing stories together. We can be like that again. <laughs> My best friend? Wouldn't my best friend listen to the things I say to them? Not a single word I've heard said has made it through to you. You don't have faith in me. You never did. I'm just a freak to you, like all the rest. I'm sorry. I am. Let me make it up to you. Shut up. You're a piece of my past. I never want to see! Don't say that. We can talk this out. I'll make things right. Anything you want me to say, I will. Just tell me how you want the story to go. Story? 
How dare you say that? Everything I say and do, my whole life, it's just a kitty fantasy to you. No, I... I... Right. Just like I thought. I should have silenced you from the start. Marin, look out! Be gone! This is... I... I was counting Rhea's attack with the ma magic wand and... And I accidentally opened a rift? How long is this? Is that... See? Oh. And I want to draw the big blue star here because... Um, by the way... I have to go. Huh? Uh, you're leaving? Where? My drawing club, remember? Yeah, you have that now. I'm making great progress in class too. I have this idea for a new completely original comic. Okay, so it's... I'm writing something too. Oh, a new one? Can you work on it together? to hear about your new stories. Who is he anyway? What does he look like? Can I meet him? Uh, no. Uh, y you can't. Why not? to have imaginary friends. What? I'm just saying, you're always talking about him, but I haven't seen him once. So it's a... Uh... I don't have to show... I don't have to show you any... I don't have to show you everything all the time, Marin. Special. Shut up! Just... Just go draw all your pictures at your, your dumb club! You like that way more than hanging out with me anyway. Wait, I, I don't. Hey, wait. Don't go. Why? Why would you say that? I'm... You're my best friend. What did I do wrong? Why? Please. I'm sorry.
This is Marin's heart. Namala? I was thinking that was right here. S sorry, I what was, was that? Oh no, go ahead. I was I was thinking the dull color is so boring. This is the magic wand after all. You're right. It should be sparkly like. Gold. Gold. Oh, you beat me to it. It's okay. Great minds think alike. We're so alike, it's cute. <laughs> well, uh, I'm not really weird like you. What? Uh, it's nothing. Kyle. Oh, crap. Oh, okay, coming. Marin! Oh, I'm coming. This is the door that teleported her to that island. I need to follow Marin. <laughs> Let's see what's in this bag. David. Let's see. We're drawing, we're drawing, and yep, another we're drawing. That's losing. Kyle again. Do you ever do anything normal at all? <laughs> Looks like Eric. What? Ah, <laughs> oh, are you two dating? Yo, Eric's dating the weirdo. Uh, I'm not. Ugh. Who'd ever want to be with a girl like you? You freak. this weird stick thing? Did you make it? The, the magic wand! Hey! That's my friend! C give it back! Liar. Who wants to be friends with a weirdo like you? Here again. So what happens when I choose the wrong path? I need to follow Marin. Where is she? She said to meet here. 
Europa. I hope she brings the story. I want to have. Kira. Useless brat. Oh, someone else. Uh, Frank. Running around town behind my back when you're supposed to be studying. I got loan sharks on my ass because of your school fees. And you can't even pass like a normal kid. This is the thanks I get, a freak kid and a useless wife. Got it. I gave you life, girl. Sorry. I'm sorry. Now, let's rip up her book. Kyle. There's an empty spot here. Should I write something? How about go die, freak? Is that too much? Nah, it's not like we're pushing her down the stairs or anything. Actually, that's not a bad idea. <laughs> hey, look! I found another one of her drawing. Ew, what even is that? <laughs> so gross. Get it, quick. <laughs> She's gonna freak. Marin in. Someone else? I see you still haven't filled out the future consultation form. What about an art or literature major? You've always been creative. that people will judge you. Don't worry. I chose art school and nobody cared at all. It's more important to do something you're interested in. It's your life after all. Easy for you to say. You know that those people treat you differently than they treat me. do it, and people let it slide or even praise you. If I did it, I'd get called a freak. You really can't see that. You can't. Or you won't, I guess. Just like always. No, I'm not. Just stop, Morin. But hey, I know you love telling stories and making art. Remember when we used to write all that stuff about our base camp? You were crazy into it. You looked happy. If it's your dream, you should fight for it. Stop it! You keep talking like I didn't even try to fight for it! 
I'm not Nirmala. I can't do it. <laughs> Wait, what are you talking about? You are Nirmala. No more. I'm an... I... I... You wouldn't understand! Anna's the only one who really understands me! He's a real person. Because he is real! I went looking for him because you always talk about him so much. But I can't find him anywhere. That's because he's not around right now. I looked in the archives, city records, the phone book, even the newspapers from the last ten years. Up. There's no mention of an Atma anywhere. He isn't real. You have to move on. We're getting too old for imaginary friends. You don't understand! I I'm sorry. Don't. I'm your best friend. What did I do wrong? Why? Why do you hate me? Snail became so obsessed with spreading her magic that she left the south alone in the deepest, darkest part of the ocean. What does the story teach us this time? Marin. Oh no! Not one step further. Namala, stop it! it! It's so sad how we grew apart. We were so close back then. If only we could have spoken our minds and be more honest about our feelings. No matter. Marin was always so keen to help. Now she can. She can help bring the end. No. No, please, don't! Why are you turning everyone to monsters? Us. We aren't changing them in the slightest. <laughs> What's so funny? You're so clueless, aren't you, boy? We aren't turning them into monsters. We're just revealing their true form. Their true forms? So Eric, Marin, Lilu? They're all monsters? That's crap! This isn't Marin. Not anymore. This is Rhea's perception of Mary, twisted by anger and jealousy. Her deeply held grudge means this is how she sees their true forms. How this is... Rhea's doing? In a way. We did all this to save Rhea. Can't you see she's getting weaker by the day? That's true. 
Her constant denial is hurting her. She locks this hatred in concealment in a pretty packaging. In this illusion, you all call your world. And if she keeps using all her energy on it, her life will be in danger. You're not serious. Crap! We need to do something. Rhea has to be able to face the things she's kept inside all this time. Shut up! That sounded like Rhea. You can't be here any longer, boy. Wait, what should I do? Go! Please. I want to understand your fantasy. Shut up! Stories. What's it going to take to get you to stop talking? Like all times. Enough with your babbling! Shut up, shut up, shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! I don't need you. Rhea, no! Don't do it! Don't interrupt. Can't you see she's in pain? We're here to feel pain, to be with her. I like the others are just up and left. As I thought, everyone's gone. Just disappear like you always do. Rhea! Thankfully, she's still breathing. This time, I'll help you, Rhea. Hello, Mr. Co-Writer. Long time no see. I know. I'm sorry I've not been around much lately. It's okay. You finally have a part-time job. That's great. Well, what about you? How's your story going? Uh, well, it's... It's a secret. <gasps> What's with the attitude? <laughs> it's late. It looks like it's gonna rain. Come on, let me walk you home. I don't want to go home. Everything is so empty and lifeless there. I can't write or draw or anything. Did something happen at home? Everything happened. I want to be like you, Emma. I want to run away from home. Emma, help me be like you. Like me? I could be independent. Live on the outskirts of town. Be free. And what will you eat? Um, I, I can eat grass. And drink dew from the grass. Uh, two for one. Lamest idea ever. Aw, oh, come on. We could be neighbors and write stories every day. 
Amala, I know you're feeling a lot of emotions right now, but it's better wait until the storm has calmed down, until you can see straight. Don't worry. In a storm, you'll find your sunrise. You're just trying to get rid of me, aren't you? Like everyone else! I'm useless! Sorry you think like that, but it's not it. I ran away from home too, to come and live here. I didn't care where I went, I just wanted to be anywhere but my hometown. Then I landed here. I didn't have anyone to count on, I lost contact with all my friends and relatives. I'm because I had this big idea to chase my dream as a writer. The reality isn't as cool as you think. I have to work hard just to survive. I don't have the any time or energy to be creative. I've almost given up, but then I met you. Your spirit, your care. Everything seems fun again. You've got a great story, so sincere and touching. You make me want to write again. More than that, you saved my life. I did? You didn't even realize. I don't know if I can fix the problems you have home, but I can help with your writing. I know that the Star Princess story is important to you, so why don't we work together to finish it? Uh, really? You mean it? I do. I promise. Uh, thank you. Will you go home now? For me? Fine. But we can stay a little long. But can we stay a little longer? At least until the sun sets? You drive a hard bargain, Miss Co Rider. Uh, uh, we'll finish the Star Princess story where whatever it takes, right, Atma? Of course. I promise it with my life. Useless. I... I'm... <coughs> coming! Coming for... you! Feels so real. Imala. This looks like the room from Imala's space time, a dream. This time, the flowers are withered. Maybe it's not a dream. Let's find Rhea. She must be she must be around here somewhere. Deepest, darkest corner of the galaxy. There lived a star princess. He caught a planet for her own creation home. This fairy tale is when I started it all. This place. Anyone? Rhea? Namala? What happened?
They're glitching. Should I do something to them? Right? What happened over there? I heard a girl was drowning. Frank. More trouble from that brat. I'll beat some sense into her. Can't you just go to school and come home like a normal kid? Pause and trouble the only thing you're good for. What is it, dear? Stop whining. And you, quit playing along with it. Can't you even keep your own daughter safe? This is a wife. Now, you're gonna be useless as a mother to my child, too? No! here. Huh? What's that? There's something displayed in this TV. A bridge? There's a person too. Namala? Take it anymore. Everything is a mess. I'm a mess. I hate you.
please. Just go. Uh, hey, don't say that. It, it's me. I'm you. Uh, don't push me away. Don't push me away. I, I can't live without you, nor you without me. We're stronger together. The only way we can get through this is as a team. Just like what Atma said, in the storm you'll find... No! I want to be a normal girl, with good grades and a family and, and family and friends that love me. Not a lonely delusional freak who killed her own real friend. the storm it happened because of your stupid idea to cross the river alone it happened because you tried to involve him in writing your pointless story I drowned because of you I don't need you Live my life properly from now on. No, don't! You're hurting yourself! I don't want you to be hurt! Bullshit. No, Rhea! Rhea, I'm here! Damn it, Rhea! Can't you hear me? Nimbala! No, no, don't go! Rhea, Nimbala, please! Let me help! Rhea, come on, Rhea! Rhea! In the end, it is nothing I can do. Not even a real person in the first place, then... The real me, the real Atma is... Dead? What am I even doing here? Rhea? I... what? Bosk, you... saved me. Yes. Despite your outstanding ineptitude, you made it this far. And for that, I salute you. Boss, I really seen Boss I met before? Who are you? Or rather, w what are you? So many questions. I'm simply a friend of the princess. Her majesty is waiting. Now go.
Please, sit with me. Uh, please, sit with me. I need a friend. You... Kamala... I... Milio. Oh. Is it still me? Yes. Oh, okay, sorry. Why are you standing or Why are you standing still? Her Majesty demands your company. No, I'm still... You still do not know what to make of us. That's fair enough. Do you, in turn, know what to make of yourself? What you really are? A specimen unbound by the laws of reality, who cannot perish in this realm. You, who seems to always be the only one left in the dark. If you want answers, then, then you need to come closer. stayed long enough to answer your call. I, I miss this. It's been a long time since we've sat together like this. I... I'm sorry. I really don't know what to say. Are you... <coughs> Are you okay? Who did this to you? B please don't mind me. <laughs> Your questions will be answered soon. Ask whatever you want to ask. We will do our best to satisfy your curiosity. Are you real? I thought you were just a kid from a dream I had. The dreams a lot of people had, for that matter. So you're real, not just a figment of my imagination. Uh, I can't be... I can't be both at that? I don't understand. Are you... our friend? Uh, you still dab with that? Uh, I really don't know, Namala. All oh, this is so foreign to me. We are all here inside a fairy tale without an ending. We won't know what's real. Until this story is finished. What are you two Rhea exactly, Namala? She's my North, and I'm herself. What do you mean? Once upon a time. Oh no. Is this a fairy tale again? You liked it before. I still do, but... Never mind. Go ahead. In the deepest, darkest corner of the galaxy. There lived a star princess who called a planner of her own creation home. Now, this star princess has met had magical celestial powers. She could grant any wish. In a flash, she could summon the most delicious food, the most wondrous delights. All but one thing. A friend. The Star Princess was dreadfully lonely. It was then that she decided to embark on a journey to make new friends. But she didn't want to abandon her beloved planet. And thus... The Star Princess split into two entities, stellar twins. The North Star Princess glowed a brilliant blue. And her and her twin, the South Star Princess, a rich, warm yellow. 
The South Star Princess left the planet to find friends in another solar system. What happened to the North Star Princess? Rhea, I mean, the North Star Princess. What happened to her? The North, in deepest quietude, felt the same pain and loneliness as itself, for their hearts were as one. But it seemed like... She began to hate the Star Prin- She began to hate the South Star Princess. And she began to hate the pain and loneliness in her heart. Perhaps, perhaps because she longed to shine brighter than the self. Her, her other half would, her other half who had left her alone in the unforgiving void of space. I don't know. I'll never be able to understand the meaning of a story that remains unfinished. And I'm not the one to finish either. Then who? Uh, of course the ending belongs to Rhea, the North Star Princess herself. <sighs> Met your in-depth explanations. What happened to the South Star Princess? She found friends on Earth. But they left eventually. Long story short, she exhausted her star magic and died. Wait, that's it? That's the ending? Uh, of, of course not. The story isn't over yet, is it? What have you been doing? I measured deep inside everyone's mind. What have you been doing to them? Ah, you mean turning Eric, Lulu, and Marin into... Sometimes you have to crack some eggs to make an omelet. I didn't know what I was doing was hurting, hurting Raya, but... I just wanted her to pay attention to me. me. To love me again, like she used to. Wasn't that a cruel cool thing to do? Those people aren't real in this world. They're just fragments of the North's memory. They don't exist in any meaningful sense. And besides, what other choice did you have? The North was... The North has been running from the truth, lying to herself. Completely detached, unbound from reality. She and the rest of this world are bound to her delusion. Just like her majesty here now. But if the Eric, Lou, and Marin that I met aren't real, then what does that make me? That is up to you, Atma. You're an anomaly in Rhea's makeshift world. Maybe you aren't the Atma she uh, intended you to be here, but... You're certainly something. Something special. Maybe you're the one that can help Rhea to face herself. What should we do now? Shouldn't I be the one asking you? Me? What? Oh, uh, look! The new fairy tale script! It's finally complete! Drowned in a dreadful sadness, the North used the last of her power to create an impenetrable barricade and hoped that no one would hurt her in the way they hurt the South. Is this... Rhea? What happens to her? be how the story ends. The cat tried with all his might to break through, but it was no use. The North had used up all her power, and not a drop was left. She remained in case of a galactic barricade, asleep for all eternity. What? For all eternity? You mean- No! That can't be! 
What kind of story is that? It can't end like this. That's why I need your help. It's up to you to make the edits, Mr. Co-Writer. Just like old times. What do you want to do now that the world is on the brink? I want to save Rhea. I can't hide here in the past forever. I want to find Rhea and save her. That's the spirit. As expected from the hero. I'm lost here, though. I need your help, Namala. What is this? What the hell is that? You're... I feel off. Something's really wrong. Um. Namala! Atma... I'm... Sorry. It seems... I can't help you after all. All this time I've been draining my power for nothing. I am now powerless. But, but you, Atma, you're still free. You must find Rhea before everything falls apart. Bring her here to go home. Namala! Namala! Damn it, she's unresponsive. What should I do? We should check outside. Come. There is not a moment to waste. I need to find a rift. has not opened properly. What? Whoa! The one, it, it shattered? Bosk! Don't just stand there, boy. Help me! Oh, on it. The fate of the North and the South is closely bound. If you want to save them, you'll have to hurry. Enter the Rift and find the North. What about you? I have my own business to attend to. You look troubled. What is it? I still... I still don't fully understand. What am I in this world? The nature of reality in Rhea and Namala. It feels like I don't know them, man. I don't know myself either. You need to understand how powerful you are. You say that, but I'm, I'm just a normal guy. The magic wand is broken now. I don't even have control over the red magic book. Oh. What is it? Out of everyone, you're the only person that isn't bound by this world of illusions. Nor are you dependent on its miracle. I have no doubt that you're on the path to realizing your potential, but you must keep moving forward, strive to endure. That's a pretty solid advice for a cat. I'm not just a, a cat. Besides, I was simply repeating something that was once said to me. Now go. Don't waste any more time. 
Take care of Namala for me. I promise the South is safe with me. When the time comes, I will come to help you. Again. Kyle. Did you hear? She fell asleep during the national exam. Mumbling about her imaginary friend again. <laughs> what a freak. She went on and on about it when I asked, too. She thought I was really interested in her cuckoo fantasy. So freaky. <laughs> Yesterday, she... No way, she really... Yeah, yeah. So what happened was... That, that voice. Huh? Why here? Rhea must be somewhere in this realm. I need to find her. What happened to this place? Admiral. You. Admiral? You filthy turncoat. You're just like those dumb kids after all. What could Ray have done to make you turn on her like this? What? I, I didn't. I'm trying to help her, to bring her home. Rhea doesn't need saving. This is where she wants to be. Haven't you ever actually listened to her? She doesn't want to go home. How could she? She wants to be happy. What right do you have to tell her any different? She... She isn't well. <laughs> You're just like the rest of them. Judging her for being different. Treating her like a helpless child. She never gets what she wants. Ever. Here she's safe and surrounded by everything she needs. If you really love her, if you really want to make her happy, you should do what she wants. You've been given a role. Sit tight and play it. Is that just enabling her? I love her too much to watch her hurt herself. You're past salvation. You leave me no choice. What are you saying, Admiral? I don't want to fight you. I don't want to fight you. you. You're my cat. You're my friend. Oh, believe me. It's not going to be much of a fight. Want to know something? What? It doesn't even tickle. <gasps> what the? The rift is too small for a majestic feline such as myself. Ugh. Ah, oh, how delightful. The second favorite cat is here. I'm Rhea's ally. 
just like you. Rhea doesn't pick favorites. Rich to call yourself an ally of Rhea's with your record. Boss, it's good to see you. Nimala, is she... Her majesty is stable. The time has come, and I am here. Go forth. I'll take care of this one. Oh? <laughs> the tomcat has quite the mouth on him. You should pick on someone your own size. Very well. You might be more entertaining than this. Pathetic excuse for a hero. What the? Are those... me? Yeah. Stop right there. Let me through! He's gone. It's the general store. Is Uncle Beauty okay? I'm not even sure where everyone is right now. Gah. Both of you, stop it! Please! No, I won't stop, traitor! We won't stop! Leave Rhea alone so she can be happy! Let me through! No time to waste. Ugh, made me sick. I care about Rhea. Let me through! Shut your mouth, you... You traitor! You don't care about Rhea! Go away, traitor! Shut up! Go away! Go away! Need to hurry. Let me through! I need to hurry. I'm not fighting with myself anymore. to give up now. There's no end to you. All this fighting is pointless. Please understand. Your treacherous defiance. That's what's pointless. We'll let you destroy Rhea's happiness. Between all of us, we'll put you down. Kind of ways. Let me through. Traders have no place in this world. No time to waste. Let me through. It's totally senseless. There's no other way. Keep pushing through. Stop! You go no further! Can you just appreciate the beauty world that Rhea created? It's not beautiful. I'm here to save her from it. Huh. <laughs> Thinking some kind of some sort of hero. Might have been. I don't really remember, honestly. Then stop playing a hero and just give up! No. I can't do that. I won't. I see. They'll stop you where you stand, traitor! You guys are gonna try and keep me busy, huh? <laughs> All of us? Not likely. Won't you make it past me? I'll show you how useless you really are! <laughs> Why am I attacked so... Well, 
one and the same. I know how you fight and how to counter it. Damn it! You have to use something other than violence. Good block. Experience hasn't betrayed you. Good block. Experience hasn't betrayed you. Sensei taught you well. Let's see how long you can last. <sighs> Just wait. I'll destroy you! Fight me, you coward! Can we settle this without fighting? It's not a peace loving crap, you dumb hippie! to share a face with a coward like you. How long are you going to keep this up? As long as you are, or until you're dead! I'll never give up, Rhea! Why won't you surrender? Now to you, hero. I'll never yield. I'll protect Rhea until my last breath. Rhea's in great... Rhea's in greater danger here. Danger? She needs help, our help, urgently, before it's too late. Can't you see it? Shut it. You don't know anything about her. No, she needs to go home. Home? There's nothing for her in that place. There's something. Someone, actually. She has the South Star Princess. The South... Princess. Princess. Ah! 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 Princess! Star Princess! Here's my chance. I can attack him now. Ugh. Why are you doing this? This world? Is there a place that Ray can be happy? No, you're wrong. This world, this illusion, can only offer a false temporary bliss. In the real world, her body fades away. I'm here to set Rhea from that fate. I talk big. Like you know what the future holds for her. I don't. All I know is that she needs to be saved right now. That's what matters. <laughs> she hoped you're right. her when she needed you the most. I was a fragment of her past, as should you be. We aren't there anymore. We can't keep haunting her like this. <sighs> I refuse to put myself on your level. I can promise you that neither heaven nor earth could move me from this position. I've had enough of your insolence. You cannot pass through. Even if it kills. <laughs> ah. It seems it's well past supper time, and we find ourselves in need of a fancy feast. Atma. Yes? Be a good kitten, and find us some food, would you? Uh...
honorable queen. Behold the food our hero has laid in front of us. Surely you don't propose to fight on an empty stomach. Uh, it is temptingly arranged in the receptacle. But I have to. <sighs> oh, screw it. That was best. Now that we've broken kibble together, it would be foolish if we couldn't see eye to eye. Both of us want the best for the Star Princess. I don't want her to be alone either, but... I can't let her hide in this world forever. Spinning in circles, chasing her tail. You're right. We both want the same thing. And you too, Atma. Of course. Yes. Promise me one thing. If I let you pass, you must save her. Whatever it takes. I wouldn't dream of doing anything different, friend. Then you may continue on your journey. Before you left, have this key. A key for what? I told you I had my own purpose. You will need it later. Now go. What about you two? It's long past our bedtime, but for now, might we see what else this world has for us, my queen? As you wish. Rhea. Atma. My darling, my love. You're here. Uh, you're ready to complete the bucket list with me? We can be together now. No one will interfere. We'll be together until the end of the world. Rhea, I... Come, Atma. Watch the end of the world with your beloved in your arms. No. I'm here to save you from this delusion. What? Let me help you. Come with me. The mall is looking for you. Stop saying that name. Do you hate me? Do you want me to suffer? I... You don't love me anymore, do you? I do! I still love you very much! Which is why I need you to go back. No! No, no, no! I don't wanna! Why won't you listen to me? I'm happy here! Tsk, tsk. You 
disappoint me, Atma. Now what? You want to beat me up and make me submit? I don't want to use violence on you. Ever. Please. Just come with me. <laughs> How kind of you. But still. <laughs> don't forget that I'm the one with the power here, my love. Listen to me or else. 